Okay, here we are now for the final matchup of this evening. We have Sersler's on the attack versus Holy Crusaders on the defense. You have different unit setups here. Let's have a look that we're seeing. You can see oh, on the defense, they're bringing Outriders, boys. They have Outriders. They have plenty of Outriders as well. Well, three or four of them. Four, four Outriders, a couple of Armagers in there, a couple of Keshiks, Flamers, IPGs, Palace Guards. We're going to see what's happening here. Are they going to sally out? There's lots of Polax players and lots of malls as well. That's going to be interesting to see what happens here. Are they going to use the malls as bit ways to stop Keshiks? And obviously, we know the abilities of Polax can stop the Keshiks and counter Cav pretty much quickly. Uh, you've got on the attack side here, they've got Palace Guards, Modals, IPGs. Yeah, they're thinking an a cavalry supply point defenses in case of sally out. So they're thinking about it, but it's outriders that you've got to worry about that will do the work. They're not taking the, the units of outriders out yet unless they're going to swap very quickly to outriders. Robert de Saba. Robert de Saba? Sable? Sable? I don't know. How do you say that in French? <laughs> Fuck, I have no idea. I don't speak no French. I can't speak French. Sable? Robert de Sable? There we go. Robert de Sable? There we go. That's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm saying. I'm saying it. That's it. Okay, let's see. How is this going to go? How is these predictions going to go? In terms of votes we have 75 percent going in the way of sarsler's 25 percent going in the way of holy crusaders it looks like you guys think sarsler's will have this one and we're going to go up into the sky here into the sky tinjev calling in the trebuchet straight away units are set up we don't have any cavalry out yet they're not even thinking about it. they've got the flamers, they've got the modals in the defense, but there's no outriders, which is interesting to have them and not use them at this stage. This, this is one of their plans to kind of look as if they're not bringing them and then at the last second use them when things are coming in. The trebs are coming in now and there's a lot of heroes backing off and going to supply points. Let's see what guys go to the supply point here. You've got Baby Dragon going to the supply point who has outriders in his barracks. Booby Diction, there's a few players there. Tinjev just baiting up and down these ladders trying to do some work. The siege towers and siege equipment are being fired and the siege towers are being pushed. You've got a sponge out here, gun bladers around in the right hand, uh, the right hand side gate. Just kind of spying outside, see what he can see here. God King Asura doesn't even notice. Is he going to start fighting here? What the flame getting fought here, King Asura. Lots of the heroes are all coming to go fight one player. It's just, it's just one Sharsard and it shows you how long a Sharsard can survive when that many heroes are going for him. But Bigger Apple picks up the first kill and he gets the drop dead achievement. But nothing here. No no units of Keshex or Outriders used here to to kind of go out and get a sally out. Gunblade, I don't know what he was doing. He was over committing himself to that supply point. He's going in Derevi. He's decided, right, I'm going to be able to stop you in that gateway but he's going to run away gunblader is going to get away with his life and he is back inside the boys are looking but looks like siege towers might make it are we going to make uh, the siege towers on the wall gotchi jumps off the wall to take out the units that are pushing the far right hand siege tower this left hand siege tower is it going to make it is it going to just make it it does make it on the left hand side and the barra, like the barricade is down, well, the main gate is down as well. They've managed to push that down. A is given away for free here from Holy Crusaders. And now they are going to be rotating and using their units in the right positions now. Where are they going to defend the points? Uh, what areas are they looking at? You can see Holy Crusaders have backed right off. They're not even fighting at the stairs. They're not even thinking about being at the bottom of the stairs like surf slayers were and pushing them off and back and forward between that. They're staying put in these little alleyways up at home base and between supply points so that they don't get trebbed, so that they're out of a position and all clustered together as close as possible so they can rotate between each other pretty much is the kind of whole script of this. As you can see, you're going to get the surf slayers boys coming in from the gate. There's going to get units set up on the wall. Um, whether they're bringing in major units here, 
up the wall and coming down the wall, or are they just going to come in one position? Tinjev, just checking to see what's there. All the heroes are coming down the side gates. They see that the, uh, the left supply point over here on our left is completely free, so they're going to go to that. Roxxon and Tinjev, just kind of going to ro roam around just, uh, just to see what heroes are around, see if they can pick anything off quickly, and get some quick hero kills, maybe quick pick up some unit kills on, on the, along the way, but nothing's around there. Tinjev is just scanning as much as possible. Mass Flims are around the back here. Just checking to see what's there. Gunbladers probably spotted it on the map here, but I don't know if they have. Mass Flims going around a long way. He can't go that way, but he was just checking to see. Gunbladers coming around to support it. You've got plenty of units all clustered up in the centre now here. Surf Slayers getting themselves in one big cluster. Bigger Apple is looking to go around the left hand side, see where these guys are going. All the Surf Slayers guys now are all moving in one direction and that one direction is towards this right supply point. Are they going to be using this as their momentum push all in one go or are they going to go elsewhere? Are they going to bait it as if they're going this way and go the other direction? That's the question. Surf Slayers are known for doing stuff like this. They'll do baits, they'll do move and then quickly go the other direction but definitely looking to come in different directions. Mass Flames and that coming through the centre. You've got three different places that they've went through. They went through the side alleyway, down through the really far end back here, and then they're starting to rotate. A lot of the defensive Holy Crusaders are starting to rotate to that supply point now. Lex, Arkan, Jackie Tree are staying on this left side here, just so they can try pushing around the other way. Tinjev, it's gone invisible. Tinjev's invisible. He is invisible, as you can see. Is he going to try and stay invisible for as long as possible? But people, people spot him. He sees him, he knows he's invisible. People knows. He's not he's he's just not falling for it. The push is coming in. The trebs are coming now from Jackie on top of that supply point area. But that's actually gonna wipe out some of their own units if he doesn't move back. It doesn't do any enemy damage really. Mass Limbs gets a kill. Couple of heroes dying here on the defense though for the supply point push. The supply point push is going well in favor of Cerslers. They're pushing him off already. The supply point is getting pushed off and capped. There's plenty of heroes there. All their heroes are there pushing off. And look at that, the attack. It's going so well that they're down to five heroes alive already. And that is that is it. Four heroes. It's just a straight home push. Why why not go straight home? Go straight home. This is a straight home push without a doubt. No doubt Cerslers are going to end this within a matter of minutes. This is If this goes the way that things are going just now, this could be a matter of minutes. Cerslers have got them down to six heroes alive and they're only just spawning in as well. So there's so many units that they can get out and block off of these supply points now and where they could come out of. They've got the Fort Abrashi all set up, they've got trebs that they can use and they could pretty much just go straight onto home. They could pretty much straight ho home call this. Holy Crusaders lost so many heroes in such a quick period of time that I, I can't see them coming back from this one already. So many heroes going to go to home point. Kara's on the home point. Two heroes that are going to die fairly quickly here. Lube is going to have to jump on. But there is nothing they can do. Like, Holy Crusaders will not get to that point quick enough. They're going to get pinched from both different sides here. Esponja trying to stay there as long as possible with heroes, fighting as many of them as possible. Two heroes surviving on the point, but the point is now being capped. They're down to nine heroes. Cav charge coming in. Couple of Cav charge here. But this looks like Surf Slayers have got Holy Crusaders with their pants down. They have no idea what to do with this, and the only reaction that they can do now is get onto the point to stop the cap. And at this point in time, doing that, with all these units on the, the attack, there, there's no way you survive on that point. Cerslers will pick it up, kill all the heroes, and literally there's nothing they can do. It's going to be a little jump on the point as long as possible, but Gunblader's going to fall to his death here. Youngs is going to pick, pick up a kill here as well. Jackie Tree, get the hat trick kills, and home point will be capped and that's it that's it they're down to four heroes there's no way these guys will get onto the point quick enough people is going to try and make an effort but there's people going on to them and Cerslers finish this up in a matter of no time that was a fantastic push on the supply point push they grabbed the supply point in the same time as they were pushing set up the units got other units out to protect the, the units uh, from the start that was coming in and that just there was nothing there from Holy Crusaders can do. They, 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 their heroes died so quickly in a matter of seconds that nothing could be done to defend their home point. Mask Flames, MVP, only one hero kill, 84 unit kills. Dark Flame, though, 8 hero kills, 86 unit kills. What in the world, man? You are smashing kids. Um, you've got Jackie Tree here with 4 hero kills, Esponja with 4 hero kills, and 
yeah, the majority of the time, there wasn't even that many, like, if you look at the unit kills, like, there isn't any over 100, there wasn't a amount of units that was that quick, they weren't even able to use their units to get the kills on their units. Uh, Defence-wise, Nutella Waffles, MVP, no hero kills, but 36 unit kills, but overall, not enough unit kills and not enough hero kills on the defence to stop major pushes like that. It all happened so quickly. It just, just couldn't do anything there. Just, they just couldn't do it. This is this is not the strat they're talked about, says Maximus, but they've changed it, so uh, I assisted them. <laughs> but yeah, 27 hero kills for Servstars versus only 6 from Holy Crusaders. Almost double on the unit kills. Yeah, I mean, I'm sorry. Well done, Servstars. Fantastic push. So quickly, well organised, 50-man push. And then when you has got that push and that supply point, the reaction to getting center units and heroes away around the other areas of the map to then get onto home and then block off their spawn points with units and using the trebs to your advantage as much as possible. The map ended in seven minutes. It was it ended in seven minutes. Overall duration, seven minutes. The majority of the kills here come around about the six minute end of the battle and that was it. Game over like that, before you can even blink and even think about it. But, well done guys, great effort for the things, that was the last matchup of this evening guys.